name is Fran Stringer. This is Pringle of Scotland at London Fashion Week. Well, um, she's being protected from the elements this season. And so we were inspired by um, a traditional way of dressing in the 1800s on the Highlands by the Scots and it's called Felic Moor and it was a technique where they used huge squares of fabric and they wrapped and draped and pinned these heavy fabrics to create outerwear and garments to protect themselves from the elements and so we have lots of in the silhouette lots of kind of squares and right angles and all this kind of draping and often secured with kilt pins um, so that's kind of um, tipping you know uh, tapping into our Scottish heritage and then obviously Obviously, also uh, tapping into our Pringle heritage, we looked at the Argyle and we worked with um, an artist called Lucy Orta and um, we came across her work. She did a project called Identity and Refuge in the 90s and she used to take, she used to take old garments, recycle them and create beautiful new garments and um, we contacted her and did a little collaboration that's what you see with the Argyle pieces that were all patched together. They're patched out of old uh, Pringle Argyle pieces to create these two unique pieces. Makeup is the idea of her. She's um, been out in the Highlands and it rained, and she's kind of a bit. Um, she she got caught in the rain, and so she's come back and she's kind of dewy and a little a little wet, and um, she, you know she wanted to put her hair back and she got a kilt pin and she tied her hair back with the kilt pin and that was the idea around the hair and makeup. Very soft and natural. She's a natural um, girl, the Pringle. And then the other pattern you had in the collection was the print and that's actually um, a floral print from our archives as well. We were very famous in the 60s and the 70s for printing on knitwear. We pioneered the technologies of printing on knitwear and um, we took a, an archive print because we loved the bold floral and the colours that they used and we did our own interpretation of the colourway. Um, but instead of printing it on cashmere this time we printed it on a viscose knit, on a rib knit so it's much more modern and sporty um, and fluid as well and we created the last look that Adwa was wearing. feel like we want to create our own clan our own tribe you know that's unique to us with such our you know such our rich heritage and we really wanted to feel like um, it was like an ageless casting um, and uh, yeah so I I'm really happy with the casting it feels kind of really beautiful and ageless and bold as well